As some of you may know, I'm a matcha girl. Uh, my go-to drink is an iced matcha latte. Look, I really think nobody does it better. I love the way that you put it together. Oh, oh, you fancy, huh? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to stop by to give you guys a little update. Um, as you can see, I got my hair done and I love it. Um, I got some knotless, waistless, waist length braids um, and it was done by Lola. Um, I'll drop her Instagram here. I found her from Kadeen's page, um, Kadeen Ellis and Sakari, her sister. So yeah, so they was getting her their hair done from her and I was like, oh, it looks really good. Let me try her out and when I say that that's my girl. I will be booking and booking and booking. It feels so like light, it doesn't feel heavy. The parts are great. All the braids are the same size. I just, I love it. So yeah, that's that. Got my hair done. A little summer protective style. Um, yeah, I posted something on Instagram where I asked everyone to drop their go-to drink for Starbucks because as some of you may know, I'm a matcha girl. Um, my go-to drink is an iced matcha latte. Oat milk, two pumps of chai, vanilla sweet cream, cold foam, and call it a day. But I wanted to try some other things, so I'm probably going to try about four, three or four of the drinks that people suggested, and yeah, so that's what we're going to be doing. So I'm going to go ahead and head to Starbucks now, and I will check back in once I have the drinks and once I'm ready to try them. So stay tuned, guys. Okay guys, so as promised, I went to Starbucks and I got three of the drinks that was recommended to me. I wanted to get four, but they didn't have um, one of the drinks that I was going to get. So yeah, they didn't have the trays, so I got these two bags for three drinks. And I got a tall because I'm not going to get a grande or anything and waste this stuff. So I got the tall, which is the smallest drink. And it's funny, I was watching Kyra on YouTube, I remember they got, um, they ordered a um, tall, and I don't know if it was her or her mom, and she was like, these sippy cups, and it's really like sippy cups for kids. So yeah, um, one of the drinks that I wanted to get that they did not have, it was a kiwi star fruit lemonade. Um, they didn't have that for some reason, so I guess that is another one that I would try a different day. But yeah, we're gonna just go ahead and jump right into it. Um, once that I decided to get their hair. So, can I get a drum roll please? Okay, drink number one is a, drink number one is a mango dragon fruit lemonade, no inclusions, two pumps of classic syrup, peach juice, and passion tea. So this is it. And I got, again, I got a tall and all the drinks. So I'm gonna go ahead and try this one. The straws are wet from like the drinks, which is gross. Um, let me grab this third. Come on, straw. Okay. Mmm. This might be my new summer drink. Thank you, Chelsea. I think. I think this one's my new go to drink. This is this is really good. I'll give this one a 10 out of 10. And again, this is the mango dragon fruit lemonade. No inclusions. One pump of classic syrup. Well, I got one because I got a tall. Um, she told me to get two. Um, peach shoes and fashion tangled tea. And 10 out of 10 recommend. Love this. Love this. Love this. Drink number two is a Strawberry aside. Yeah, strawberry aside. Refresher. So, I might have had this once before. I really can't remember right now, but let's see. And I didn't add anything to this. I don't know if I was supposed to. I literally just asked for a strawberry aside. All right. 10 out of 10 recommend again. And I'm not just giving these drinks a 10 because I'll be really honest. This reminds me of like a fruit infused water, but it has like a sweet taste, but it's not overly sweet. So this, I'll give it a 10. 
I think this might be another one of my go-to drinks. Because again, I am a matcha girl. I love me an iced matcha latte and probably like a pink drink. But these two so far, the um, mango dragon fruit lemonade mix up that I got here and the strawberry acai refresher, these two, I'll give you both a 10 out of 10. Yes, 10 out of 10. I need to get another coaster, which is over there. Um, give me one second, guys. Okay. I had to go grab some more coasters because I am not into messy making. Oh, I got these coasters from um, Amazon. They're so cute. Okay, so yeah. And for the last drink that I got, hopefully I like this because I think this one may be a bit sweeter and I'm not really like into the um, fraps and stuff anymore from Starbucks. But what I did do, um, I substituted, I put oat milk in here. I wasn't gonna um, go for the whole milk and you know upset my stomach or anything like that. So this one is, um, what is this? Oh, it's a caramel ribbon crunch. And again, I put oat milk and I took on whipped cream. Other than that, I got it exactly how it comes. So it's getting a little bit, it's melting a little bit now, so I'm probably gonna put it in the freezer, but. It's not bad. So I don't wanna be dramatic. But um, again, this is probably like these two drinks that I had previously, they are drinks that I probably would drink like on a daily or on a regular, like a hot day, like how it was today outside. It's just extremely hot, by the way. I normally go outside when the sun is down, but I went out early to do this video for you guys so I can edit it and have it up today. But um, yeah, back to this caramel French crap. All right, for starters, I think just me cooking home it melted a lot, so I think that's throwing me off. The consistency of it is like liquidy a little bit, but it's not bad. I'm gonna put it in the freezer. Mm. It's actually not bad at all, it's actually good. But this would have to be something I drink like when I'm having like a sweet craving, like when I want something really, really sweet, or like what is that time of the month? Cause you know, you start craving sweets and stuff, well at least I do. So yeah, this would probably be a go-to drink for that time. But this wouldn't be like an everyday drink. Again, it's not nasty. It's just not like my drink preference. But I would give it like a seven out of 10. Cause it's good. It's just not, a, it's not something that I would go to. But yeah, so that's that. I got a few recommend, I got a few um, recommendations. Thank you to everybody who gave me suggest suggestions when I posted to drop your go-to Starbucks drinks. And these are the three. These are the three that were recommended to me. And I think they're in the order that I like them actually. The Strawberry Star Refresher, the Mango Dragon Fruit Lemonade with Passion Tango Tea, Peach Juice, Classic Syrup, and no inclusions. And then the Caramel Crunch Frappe for last. So yeah, I may post this video again in a few weeks because I'm probably going to the Starbucks break after this. Um, yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching. Again, these are just three new Starbucks drinks that I wanted to try. If you want to order my go-to drink, it is a iced matcha latte with oat milk, two pumps of chai, vanilla sweet cream, cold foam, and light ice. I always get light ice because I'm not about to pay for a cup of ice, so yeah, I get light ice. And if you're not already aware, Starbucks is having 50% off a I think it's ice beverages um, throughout the month of July every Tuesday. So I went and got my venti the other day and it was like 326 or three something. So yeah, make sure you stop into Starbucks on Tuesdays for your 50% of your ice drinks. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you want, feel free to drop down your Starbucks recommendations down below and I will definitely give them a try. Also, um, follow me on Instagram, this is my Instagram here, because I will be posting more polls and 
I'm gonna be doing an updated Q&A soon. So I will post questions on my Instagram. So again, follow me on Instagram and I will check in with you guys soon. So as always, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. More content will be coming soon. And if you have any ideas of any videos or anything you wanna see, um, drop them down below. I know you guys did enjoy my haul, so I am gonna be doing a few more hauls soon. And as I mentioned in a previous vlog, I have two other things I'm cooking up. So um, yeah, that, stay tuned for that, that's coming soon. But yeah, as always, thank you for watching and I will be back with another video soon.